ladies and gentlemen, a wonderful, wonderful welcome to you this afternoon to the ceremony and celebration for Michael and Allison. They have come to be made one in holy matrimony. We would like to thank God for a beautiful day today. And we would like to thank Michael and Allison for not choosing yesterday. <laughs> We are gathered here in the presence of God and all of you witnesses to join Michael and Allison in holy matrimony. It is instituted of God, wonderfully regulated by his commands and indeed blessed by our Lord Jesus Christ. So much so that he chose a wedding to perform his first miracle. Before we begin to say anything else, can we have a good clap and a great big cheer? Let it last for a little while. Let us pray. <laughs> Eternal God and our Father, for this special day, this wonderful location, and for this awesome occasion, we offer to you our heartfelt thanks on behalf of Michael and Allison, their family and their friends. As they exchange vows, and rings and enter into a covenant agreement this afternoon as husband and wife as they begin this new chapter and this new journey in their lives together as husband and wife. I love you as certain dark things are to be loved in secret between the shadow and the soul. So I love you because I know no other way than this where I does not exist nor you so close that your hand on my chest is my hand. So close that your eyes close as I fall asleep. Michael, will you have Allison to be your wife? And will you pledge your faith to her in all love and honor, in all duty and service, in all faith and tenderness, to live with her and to cherish her according to the ordinance of God in the holy bond of marriage? If so, say, I will. Allison, will you have Michael to be your husband? And will you pledge your faith to him in all love and honor, in all duty and service, in all faith and tenderness, to live with him and to cherish him according to the ordinance of God in the holy bond of marriage? If so, tell him, I will. I will. Michael, please repeat after me. Talk to her. I, Michael, <laughs> I, Michael. <laughs> take you, Allison, take you, Allison. To, be my wedded wife. to be my wedded wife. I, Allison, Allison. take you, Michael, take to be my wedded husband. And I do promise, I do promise. and covenant before, God. covenant before God, and these witnesses, and these witnesses. to be your loving you. and faithful wife, as long as we both shall live. I, Michael, give you, Allison, this ring and my heart. I take you now as my wife. I, Allison, give you, Michael, give it to him, this ring and my heart. I take you now as my husband. So, by the power vested in me as a minister of the gospel and the laws of the land of Bermuda, I now declare that you, Michael and Allison, are now husband and wife together. What God has joined together, let not man or anything put you asunder. Michael, it's over now, sir. <laughs> Why don't you seal your vows with a kiss? Come on, folks, let's clap and cheer. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, would you please stand? May I present to you, for the very first time, 
the very brand new Mr. and Mrs. Michael Broderick. Give it up for them, please. For, for vodka and sarcasm. And, uh, and, and together, I wish you luck with that. Um, and I really, I guess, I love you, Pumpkin. Mike, love you. So. Don't matter why, every day and night, baby, all the time, you're in my heart, you're on my mind. I 
glassy skies of blue and clouds of white. The bright blessed day, the dark sacred night, and I think to myself, what a wonderful world. The colors of the rainbow, so pretty in the sky, are also on the faces of people going by. I see friends shaking hands, saying, how do you do? They're really saying, I love you. I hear babies cry. much more than I never knew, and I think to myself, what a wonderful world, yes, I think to myself, what a wonderful world.